This is probably going to be a really fast-paced game. Um, how much in the scouting report are you guys talking about their their speed? And are you guys going to change anything, or are you just going to go out and play your game? Uh, we're going to we're going to play our game. I mean, <laughs> defensively, we have to get back and look at the ball because they really inbound it real quickly and try to get, we got to beat the pressure up the floor and get the easy bucket. But we just got to get back on the defense and look at the ball. Everything else is pretty much the same. We just uh, going to play our style of basketball. How will that affect it when they're getting the ball inbounds quickly? I mean, Colorado State seemed to just let you guys set up. Um, uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be really different, different, uh, different. But we've been practicing like this all week uh, of how they inbound the ball. Um, and some of the practice, like we, some of the practice we have, like different people throw the ball in, like not even us taking it out, down, just throw it in, just trying to get a feel of how they're gonna do it. And I mean, we kind of adjusted to it, and I think we're gonna handle it pretty well. And I kind of feel like if our players get a chance to set up, man, we're really gonna cause trouble. The, the Oregon players just spoke, and they said their half court sets could possibly give you guys some troubles. What have you guys seen in the last week? Looking at film that you're worried about going into this Oregon game or that you guys have stressed that they're really good at? Uh, I mean, they're really good on the backboard. I mean, all, all the players, you know, they really go to the guys really well. I mean, but the half court says, I mean, we really watch them and kind of look at, you know, like what they're going to do in their plays. I mean, we don't know the exact play that they're going to run, but when they get into it, we kind of know what, what's coming and what's the end is supposed to be for that play, so we can kind of break it up. But, I mean, overall, we just got to play defense how we would normally do. I mean, we have a game plan. We're just going to go in and execute. You, you mentioned back Boards, that's you. Uh, how, how big is rebounding in this game for specifically you and Shane? I mean, it's like uh, in the last game, Colorado State, uh, there was the number one rebound team. Rebound is real big in that game, and we're really just going to carry it over this game. I mean, the four man Kazemi really goes to the guys on the offense and the defense the end, but I mean, we're just going to keep them out like we did against Colorado State. I mean, I got the feeling, I just feel like we can keep Colorado State whole team from out really the mind. I mean, we can keep one person off the guard. You guys, you guys play roughly eight, nine, eight, nine, nine guys now. If the bench had not Developed? Do you guys think you'd be in the Sweet 16? I mean, I kind of, really, I kind of do, because I mean, we got great players on this team. I mean, we got guys that can score the ball all over all over the place. I mean, we have Rush, Peyton, Shane. I mean, Wayne. We have guys that can score the ball all over the place, and I mean. I kind of feel like if we get into our press, like it's not a lot of people that can really handle our press. So, I mean, yes, I still think we'll still be here. Have you guys got to shoot? Is the backdrop any different with the bigger stadium, Lucas? Oh, uh, we haven't been out there yet, I mean, but we get the chance to go out here in the next couple of minutes and get some shots up and kind of get a feel of how it's going to be. Cool.